Hello, RPG Don here. Welcome back to another tutorial about plugins made by HemeWorks. Today's plugin will be the Comment Event Queue plugin. Normally, if you have an item that tries to execute multiple common events at once, the game will only run one of them. The rest do not happen. This plugin allows you to be able to run multiple events at once. First, we'll go to this site, MV Plugins, Event Tools, Common Event Queue, scroll down to download, right click download here, save link as, download it to your computer, go back to your software, game, open folder, JS, plugins, and move your common event queue plugin here. Next, we'll go to our plugin manager, double click a row, name, common event queue, click OK, and no further action is required for the plugin. We will, however, make our common event. We'll go to our database cogwheel, common events, and make a common event to do what we want. For this tutorial, we'll make a common event that will give us a random fruit when we execute it. First, we'll go to items to make our fruit. We'll make an apple, a pear, and a berry, give them names and images, then make another item called the fruit bag with a name and image, make sure it's consumable, then click apply. Now we'll go back to our common event, name our common event, get fruit, double click our black diamond, Control variables, single and click the row, make a variable called a random fruit, apply, OK, choose random, make your smaller number 1 and your bigger number 3, then click OK. Now we will make three conditional branches. On the second black diamond, we'll make our first conditional branch. Tab 1, variable, random fruit, 1. On the last black diamond, another conditional branch, variable, random fruit, equals 2. Last black diamond, our last conditional branch, variable random fruit equals 3. Under if random fruit equals 1, we'll click it, show text, let our player know they got an apple, click OK, click the diamond under you got an apple, tap 1, change items, the scroll box, apple, and increase by 1, then click OK. Under if random fruit true, we'll let our player know they got a pair, click OK, under you got a pair, tab 1, Change items, scroll to pair, and increase by 1. Then under if random fruit 3, show text, let our player know they got a berry, and then under that, tab 1, change items, our berry, and increase by 1. Once this is done, we can apply, then head back over to our items, our fruit bag, double click a row, our other tab, common event, and get fruit. We'll click OK, and then add the event twice more for a total of three times. Click Apply and OK. We'll then right click on our map, Quick Event Creation, Treasure, Item, and change it to our Fruit Bag, then click OK. We can now test our game. Always remember to save your changes before testing. We can then open a chest, check our items, use our Fruit Bag, and see all three of our common events take place with our variable giving us a random fruit on each open. That's it for this plugin. Please like and subscribe to show your support. Gain access to our private Facebook page where we hold polls to see what class will be next on our custom class series by supporting us on Patreon. Thank you for watching. See you on the next video.